what's up guys welcome back to another video i know it's been a while but i got something new today as you can see behind me that is a subaru forester it's a 2002 pick it up today kai drove me to the guy's house because i didn't have a ride there but i seen it on marketplace earlier this week and i thought it was a deal went there checked it out liked it bought it so I'm gonna do a walk around the car right now. So it'll be like uh, as is how I bought it. And then hopefully down the line, I keep it maybe a few years or more because it, I, I really like it. This is the first Subaru I've ever owned. And I usually dogged on Subarus, but I, I, I really, really, really like it. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and you can check it. All right, so it is on lowered on coilovers, I really believe. Not sure of the brand. No idea what these wheels are, but they're they're clean. They're seventeens. You know, I got the Drift X, I guess, on one side and just the cover on the other side. So that's weird. Uh, you know, coming off. Um, as you can see, they had some overheating issues. They did the head gasket. And some other stuff. Uh, Twenty thousand miles ago, it is at one seventy-seven thousand. But check this. That's a monster energy can, as a catch can. Cold air intake, you know. No filter. I'm gonna put one on. I wanted to like show you guys as is how I got it before I touched anything. I already bought like a clay bar kit. I'm gonna clay bar it, uh, de, -iron, de iron it all around. Not sure if there's much swirls, but I mean, the paint is looking hella good for 2002. Ooh, and I painted Rihanna's fenders. Ooh, with Clyde. Yeah, looking a lot better than the black than how we got it. So we can get a paint match. But this car, the only, the biggest con is it's a salvage title. They said he's, he's owned this car for six years and he said it got rear ended. You can see the dent here and recently got it aligned. They didn't see any like damage in the frame, but it did get rear ended, like I said. So, and the crash bar in uh, behind the bumper is all smashed or pushed in. So, I guess that's why they deemed it salvage. Now, let's go on the inside. No, no dirty. <clears throat> I have a wet vac or an extracting vac for like stains like this. So, yo, they gave us a piece of wood too. That was weird. But uh, yeah, whatever that is, cracked. But that's like two bolts on each side. It could just come off. So I'm gonna try to find one locally. Of course, you can only get five speed. Oh yeah. Even has the OEM uh, uh, privacy cover in the back. See, this is the only turn to see is this. Like I said, 177,000 miles. It actually has a straight pipe, but I believe stock headers. Go ahead and start up. Oh, and it has AC. Woo! Check engine for O2. I'm gonna change that maybe a couple weeks from now or whenever I have time. Got the, the, the stop sign piping is what quote unquote Kai and uh, Clyde said. Stop sign. But yeah, this is, I guess, the new daily. But I'm gonna clean it up. And we're gonna, me, Kai, and Rihanna's gonna go to a shoot. But that bolt pattern is five by 100, and I'm gonna try snap on these four stones onto there, see how they fit. And if they don't, they don't match, then I'm gonna put, or I'm gonna try out these JNCs. These are 17s and that's 18s. Hopefully it fits, cause it looks like 
need like a really high offset but I have no idea oh and I forgot added new wheels to the stang ESR CS11s Ooh, it's slacking on the videos bro Kai got me motivated we'll put his uh, link for his channel in the description Yeah, I want to actually clean this up too to make sure that there's nothing like there's not still leaks. But as you can see, it's like kind of trying to peel, so I want to try and get a new radiator as soon as possible because I'm not trying to bust the radiator anytime soon. Really. Oh, right. I want to change this. So I have a speed performance cash can from my Mazda Speed from a long time ago. Like I, I used it for like a couple months. And it's practically brand new. I believe this is the so it goes in this way and then out. Not sure where I'm gonna mount it yet, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and wash the car, and then I'm gonna try on the wheels, the bar stones, the work fakies, and uh, the JNC wheels in the garage. See, see which one I like and then I'll, I'll get back to you guys a record see show it to you guys and you guys give me your opinions in the comment section and probably vlog when we go to shoot with Kai honestly because you know I gotta get a vlog in life not just installs not just installs but yeah see you guys after I put the wheels on so I removed the front license plate slapped on my JNC's and as you can see it's pretty perfect fitment honestly so i don't think i'm gonna slap these ones on because these are more aggressive like it's wider and i believe same offset at 35. <clears throat> so these are 17s those are 18s like i said i actually kind of really dig the 17s it, it fits the the wagon kind of look also i took out the rear uh the splash guards all around the fronts, they were on straight, but for the rears, so since the car was so low, I guess the previous owner, like when, it was like right here, when they were reversing and they kind of just folded in since it's plastic. So I took it off. Now I'm going to go ahead and, uh, oh, actually, the only thing I'm really worried about is, so these are not rolled, and this part right here is what I'm worried about. So I'm going to go ahead and wash the car. I don't know if I have time to clay bar before this is something. I'm just gonna wash it down and uh, deionize it and then wash it down and take it around the block. Hopefully, it doesn't rub because that would suck. But it's not like these wheels are not nice anyway. So, if it rubs, I'm just gonna go ahead and slap these back on for now and then I guess shave that part in the fenders or um, maybe roll it. I don't, I don't know if that's rollable because of that. Yeah, already modding it as I just get it. Well, I guess wheels, wheels and tires. Is that a mod? Simple mod, I guess. Yep. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash the car now. What's up guys, it's a week later. Had this for a week, Forrester. As you can see, I got the JNC wheels on from the Neon. Woo. I just wanna try them on and um, they actually fit pretty good. I wanna go ahead and put the stocks on after this because there's like little rubbing in the front because it's not rolled yet. But I'm at this spot right here, sunset. I'm gonna take some shots and hopefully they come out sick. I actually took off the the splash guards right there. They look better. I might put it back on if I fix them, like bend it back, but we'll see. I also did a paint correction, just really basic. There's like no swirls now and you can actually 
like see the reflection it's pretty sick but yeah guys that's pretty much the wagon welcoming it to the family it's gonna be my daily driver i said that for like all the cars i buy but this one actually is a wagon it's it's na so you know you, no sense really making it fast but hope you guys like it i actually have some like free mods i guess in mind and i want to put a cash can because i don't know if i showed you guys there's a monster can as a cash can in there <laughs> and it, it, it's just really really not not nice in there we'll see we'll see but that's it for this video guys thank you see you in the next one Dudes. Bye. Bye.